Many mid-tier commercial real estate buildings have opportunities to reduce operating expenses and increase property values through energy efficiency. An energy efficiency walkthrough is a great place to start. This walkthrough has no cost other than a few hours of time for the building operator and superintendent and often reveals immediate low and or no cost actions that will drive savings. Equipment and service vendors may be willing to participate in the walkthrough to share their technical expertise. Let's use an example. 555 Maple Road is a four-story mixed-use building with multiple tenants and a restaurant on the ground floor. The building supervisor and operator have been tasked by their management to use low and no-cost energy measures to eliminate as much energy waste as possible. They conduct an energy efficiency walkthrough on an annual basis during a different season each year, sometimes accompanied by one of their vendors for technical support. The supervisor and operator at 555 Maple Road use the energy efficiency walkthrough to answer three important questions. What equipment is consuming energy and costing money when it isn't needed? These opportunities are easiest to find during hours when key systems are not in use. So check heating system settings early in the summer and cooling systems in the fall to ensure they are not left on and consuming energy unnecessarily. Also, check heating, cooling, ventilation and lighting settings during unoccupied hours and in unoccupied spaces. During the walkthrough at Maple Road, the operator found out-of-date ventilation and heating schedules in two suites. They also discovered that the garage ramp heater hadn't been shut down. Simply turning that off in the spring and fall saved the building $2,000 in electricity. What equipment is wasting energy by working harder than necessary? Many ventilation and pumping applications in mid-tier buildings are good candidates for speed control using new motor technologies or variable frequency drives, also known as VFDs. The building supervisor found aging motors in many fan coil units and made the decision to replace them with electrically commutated motors or ECMs. ECMs use integrated speed control and permanent magnet technology to improve performance and reduce heat inside the motor. In addition to cost savings, the project reduced utility bills, improved indoor air quality, decreased maintenance on fan motors, and improved ventilation. Ventilation fans, circulator pumps, and cold water booster pumps may lead to big energy and cost savings using VFDs. The operator identified several high-usage fan and pump systems and asked their HVAC vendor to prepare an estimate of project costs and return on investment. Is any large equipment nearing end-of-life replacement? This step is another opportunity to involve equipment vendors, either virtually through video conferencing or in person when the situation allows. Incentives are available through the Save on Energy Retrofit program to offset the cost of new high-efficiency chillers that will save your facility energy and money for decades after they are installed and reduce tenant comfort calls. The team at Maple Road noted that the chiller was scheduled to be replaced in a few years and flagged it for their next discussion with their vendor. At 555 Maple Road, the building operator and superintendent used the building walkthrough to make immediate operational improvements, including updating HVAC schedules and resetting the garage ramp heater. Following the walkthrough, they called their HVAC vendor to retrofit 20 fan coil units with ECMs and added a VFD to one circulator pump. Together, these activities led to electricity savings of $12,000 per year. The additional net operating income from these projects also increased the building's property value by approximately $260,000. Building on that success, the team plans to have the building recommissioned next year to ensure that key systems are tuned and functioning properly. As the Maple Road example shows, an energy efficiency walkthrough is a low-cost approach to reduce energy waste, identify high-value upgrades, and increase a property's net operating income. Building recommissioning is a systematic process to improve an existing building's performance through identifying low-cost or no-cost operational improvements to increase comfort and yield energy savings. In short, taking what you have and making it better. The Save on Energy Retrofit program offers prescriptive incentives for HVAC system controls, ECMs, variable frequency drives, chillers, and other common energy efficiency upgrades as well as application support and technical assistance from Save On Energy Retrofit representatives.